What's good, YouTube? Your boy Bosco once again here in the city of Glendale. About to check out some stores. We're looking for those Jordan 7s to see what they look like in hand and see if that quality is good enough. If you didn't know, we just cracked 30K subscribers. So I wanted to give a big thanks and shout out to everybody who watches the channel who's been supporting me from day one. Of course, I couldn't do this without y'all. Now let's go ahead and check out some stores. Hit the like button and share it the video. I have here, bro. First time seeing this in hand. I remember talking about this on the way. Now it's finally here. The honeycomb colorway of the MBO2. Not a bad colorway. Let me know what you guys think. By far, I think this is the best colorway out recently. Still full retail. We talk about LaMelo, man. He came out with some bangers, man. These colorways for his MBO2 is on point. I remember going crazy for this Jade colorway when it first dropped. You know what I'm saying? They definitely executed the MBO1 and O2 well as far as the colorways and silhouettes and collabs. They also here have the uh, a bigger size of the Jordan 6 Red Oreo. Leather looking really plush on this one. Pretty sure this is a size 13 in hand. Got these Converse here for the ladies. Yeah, of course, always, you know what I mean? It was, it was. I like this bold green colorway. They got some, like a trio colorway of um, NMDs for the ladies, all 99 bucks. This one probably stands out the most orange one than the pink one in my opinion let me know what you guys think and all the next gen lebron 20s even some lebron 19 still here this is one that you don't see too often they got it down to 79 bucks pretty clean colorway on this lebron 19 latest colorways one of the more recent colorways of the zoom freak 3 waiting for that zoom freak 4 to actually hit or let me see it you know what i mean but uh our four these are the fours and the fives is coming out alphabet colorway i'm here and talk about some hats really quick look at these they got the A's and Angels, World Series 1974. Fitted hats though, 46 bucks. The color combination on here, New York, Boston Red Sox, New York, LA. I like what they got going on with these hats right here. The ones here too, and they got these Cubs. Like the detailing of these hats, a little pricey still. Of course, we're gonna look for them semi-annual sales. They even got them in red too. Dunk selection's pretty the same. They do have a... So they do have a new colorway of a Dunk High. I like this color combination. I split down the middle with the uh, outsole. They even have Dunks here on sale for 120 and 85. So we got a split colorway of the Air Force One. You know the Chicago split Dunk Low is out here right now. This is kind of similar color blocking to that. The green mids. I like the color blocking on these too. They are doing that split uh, Nike suit situation and outsole. It's red, black, and white colorway. You definitely can't go wrong. Can't go wrong with. You got the cell midsole here. These Air Force ones aren't bad. We definitely seen them before. Suede and mesh materials on the upper. The hyper green Air Force ones. Jordan one mid Palomino. You guys a fan of this colorway? Goes right in line with the Palomino Jordan threes that's coming out around the corner. What do you guys think about these compared to the highs? These here today, which is crazy. If you guys watch my live streams, I haven't went live since I've seen it, but they've been finding these at Ross already. Ross and Marshalls have been popping up with these and they're still in store, which is crazy. Last time we came, they had so many sell signs here. Finally got it in hand, Jordan 7. Let me know what you guys think about these. The new book on here is not bad. They got some good quality on here, bro. Definitely see these sitting for a minute though, just because it's not a shoe that everybody really going crazy for. And six is still here available, which we've seen at the outlets like crazy. None of these other shoes here are surprised to be here, but this was the release of the day. So I wanted to talk about it to see what you guys thought. Let me way. I think we've seen this at one of the other stores recently. I like this color combination. Got the maroon, the silver, and of course the 3M on the upper. Let me know what you guys think about these. Everything here we've already seen before. I am kind of impressed by this, but the materials could have been better. I call this like the Mocha Low, in my opinion. Here's the selection of Jordans for the women and pretty much everything else we've seen here before. And there still is a good amount of stuff on sale too. Don't remember if I've seen this one before, but I do know they have one with this print all over the Air Force One. 120 on the retail for the ladies. Let me know if you guys are feeling this colorway. A new colorway of the Witness 7. This one I haven't seen yet. A lot of colorways for the Witness 7 as the Witness 8s are around the corner. Definitely a, bad, a dope shoe uh, for a budget model, 105 on the retail. About this Curry 327, not mad at this color combination. Pretty cool, light shoe. $85 on the retail, Curry's budget model. They also got it in the black colorway too. I like the logo on the back heel. 85 bucks on the retail. And of course they got the John Morant. What's this, the Emerald Glow? Did you guys pick this colorway up? Let me know what you guys think. There are some more colorways coming out that are looking pretty interesting for the shoe. 
Give me your thoughts about this one. This colorway out of 550 New Balance. Let me know what you guys think about this color combination. I like this uh, forest green colorway on the 550 as well. What do you think about this 990? Been seeing some dope colorways of this shoe. This one's pretty cool even though it's black, white, and gray. For 140, man, if you guys haven't let me know your thoughts on this Karachi run, let me know if you guys are feeling these or not. Another colorway of the Air Max Pulse, Nike's newest model. Let me know if you guys like this 150 on the retail. They need some better colorways though, to be honest with you. This new spin, another colorway once again on the Air Max 270. So many colorways of this shoe. Let me know what you guys think about this. Another colorway of the Scorpion. This shoe is weird, bro. I gotta try it on at some point. 250 for the retail. Do you guys own any of these? I definitely talked about these before and I'm feeling this colorway right here. University Blue. A reduced section with a lot of different things that are marked down on sale. And they got a pretty good size run of everything. Size eight through 13. They need to drop that down from 140 though. Pretty main selection here at Shoe Palace. They still have the LeBron next gen in the purple colorway here, along with the Jaw One Emerald Glow. Pretty main selection here. LeBron's on deck too, which you starting not to see too much. I don't know if people scoop these up or I just don't see them at a lot of places. Green colorway. The green colorway here is pretty dope on this 1906. I might have talked about this before, but the colorway just stood out to me as I see, you know, all these new balances right here posted up. Got this white and navy blue 2002R with some really plush leather on there. Not a bad colorway. Good quality on here. 139 on the retail. So we got a new colorway, new colorway of the Stadium 90. Now this one is pretty impressive. I like that brown upper, cell missile, Travis Scott vibes of course. People might scoop these up because of that reason alone. The Jordan 2 Low Cherry Wood, definitely a dope colorway. One thing that I don't see here is the UNC Jordan 2 Lows. I think you guys can let me know, have we seen this navy blue colorway? Here, this color combination is pretty dope, 99 bucks on these. Suede material. Definitely clean for Adidas Originals. What do you think about this color combination on this uh, Jordan 1 High Elevate? Not bad. Got the orange on there, basketball type material. Pretty clean. The fakes here in the Panda colorway. I guess they gotta try them in every colorway to see which one's gonna actually sell. What is School Henderson gonna do when he returns? This is this shoe from Puma. What do you guys think about this? See, my lovely Foot Locker now it's a stand store. Only stand socks and apparel, which is crazy to see, bro. What do you guys think about these? We've definitely seen them before. The classic Reebok with the pump on it, bro. Can't go wrong with that at all. The stores, and I don't see this LeBron too often. The capsule and the bottle, maybe the Undercrown collab. Pretty clean colorway, though, for real. You don't see this KD15 at too many locations either, but they got them here, 50 years in hip hop. I buy Dick Sporting Goods briefly to see what they had on the shelves when it comes to Nike basketball. A lot of the stuff here we've seen before already, nothing really new. Zion's and Trey Young's on sale, like we would see at most places. But then this is what throws me off a little bit. Size 12 of the John Morant day one, this must be a return. You can see some dirt on it, so maybe they got one size left. Look, definitely look like it was worn before, around the sock liner. Somebody wore these a couple times and then returned them and they still probably got their full money back. That's crazy, bro. But that is the game. All white with the black trim on the Witness 7 as well. Definitely seen other color combinations of black and white, but not this one. This color combination on this Air Max 90, I do believe we've seen it before, but I'm not for sure. 130 on the retail. Pretty clean though. GT Cut 2. Haven't seen this colorway. I feel like it's the WNBA vibe. We're on the women's side. What is that on the back? 24. Are these like a special edition? Uh, featured player in the WNBA. If you guys know what it is, comment down below. The color combination is definitely on point though. The way the Air Max 90s right here for the women. I do like this one too, the all white with that little hint of the blue on there. That's definitely a summer vibe for this Air Max 90. And we've talked about this colorway before. Pretty clean. Sporting Goods does have some Jordan Retros for gray school. These are men. These are like the same pair that was here last time. Good to see that they have a Jordan selection here though. Different look at the Air Max 270. This gray colorway with the triple swooshes on the side. Actually four swooshes. Jordan's here. The 678. What do you guys think about this one? Honestly. Trash? Or is it one that you guys can go with, man? And of course, we got those six rings in the back, which I do like. And this colorway for the six rings is definitely on point. 
not in the sport but the cleats some of these cleats are crazy looking this is just gonna be a small brief part of the thing but look at these cleats bro some of these cleats would make me want to play the actual sport bro i mean just look at these bro i would play soccer or football right now i'm not about to go through all of them but they got a lot of dope cleats here let's go into this new new improved nike let's see what's going on here nice and cool up in here look at these i like the colorway on these i think we've seen these before pretty clean on the trail run their selection here is pretty mean as you guys can see some of the stuff they still have here on deck jordan one yellow toes we got the unc toes right around the corner pretty good sizing here they got a couple sizes left for those they said air max ones we definitely seen these before not sure how many sizes left they have usually these are just one-offs but this they do have a few sizes in not sure about this dunk i didn't ask about that only shoes i asked about was this one and this jordan one and they have one more size in this jordan one as well we've definitely been seeing these at the outlets like crazy i thought the undefeated you know air force ones would have did better at least one of the three colorways and of course we got the wash black jordan three lucky greens bigger size right here too definitely like this shoe and then of course we got some dunks the dunk high and then these reverse brazils Jordan highs, Jordan mids, Jordan lows, pandas, bro. Pandas just, I gotta take that picture because pandas just sitting on the shelves is just a different thing that we gotta get used to nowadays. They also have these dunks here too. They do have sizes left here because these are on the aisle actually, but I'm just surprised that this it says premium leather, the college inspired hue outfits of the 80s icon. Then we got the Terra Kiger 9. Not a bad colorway for this as well. 40, pretty clean colorway. That blue with the yellow underneath there. Can't go wrong with that. 130 on the retail. They got this style also here on the uh, Air Max 90. Not a bad color combination. i have seen this colorway on this design of the Air for or the Jordan 1 Low. Pretty clean colorway right here. For the ladies, only $115 on the retail. Same type of vibe or material on this one right here too. Not mad at this color combination. Let me know if you guys are feeling this or not. Then they got these on deck, which I think is cool. The Safari style Air Max 1. This colorway is not bad. They have sizes available for this one too. But actually, no, they don't have sizes left. They got this dunk low and this one. So they got dunks here, plenty of dunks here. Pretty cool. Not too bad over here. What do you guys think about these? These are not bad. 130 on the retail for these. This selection here, which one of these shoes do you guys have in your collection? you wish you had in your collection or they shouldn't even made but there's a lot of things here that you guys can go ahead and scoop up the merchandise too some of this stuff is really dope it's just be priced too crazy we gotta wait for these things to hit the outlet that's one thing that i try to encourage you guys yeah it's great to buy stuff from the retail store but if you have a little patience or a little time in your hands go ahead and check out ross burlington and Marshalls, you might be able to find some of the same stuff in the store for like a fraction of the price. I'm not just saying that to be a commercial, it's real talk. Design style store out here in Glendale is pretty dope. I mean, they do got some selection of stuff, nothing too crazy, nothing too hyped. But what's dope is you can scan the barcode to see what sizes they have, and I guess the price point. I'm assuming you can use your Amazon account to purchase stuff from here. Am I able to shop here with my Amazon account? Yes. yes. Really? Yeah. yeah, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna scan all the, uh, the QR code uh -huh. on, the, on any of the items, okay. and then it will like, let you pick like any size that you want, and then figure out the thing. So once it gets you started, you can scan this, uh -huh. Uh -huh. and it will lead you directly to like um, the scanning. So okay. you can scan all your items. Okay. Our stuff, we got some Adidas Ultra Boost down there. I'm sure these are the prices that you wouldn't want to pay for them. Adidas, Sambas here. They got some pretty good stuff here, especially at the, you know, for it to be Adidas. This is a deal, 133 as opposed to 190 for these. So this store even has some deals in here too, bro. Yeah, you guys can come here and scan the QR codes like I thought. It lets you know what sizes and everything is available, and then they'll bring it up to the front if they have it here, bro. This is crazy. And they definitely have different brands. We've seen, we've seen Reebok, we've seen Adidas. QR code to see if the stuff is here. It looks under 60 bucks. Let's show y'all the different things you guys can buy here. I like this. They got clothes, they got shoes. Like I said, only select things, but they do got some cool little things here. Like, what's this? Screenshot? Never heard of screenshot. Have you guys heard of screenshot? Shirt's pretty dope though. I like this little concept right here. You know, I'm big on Amazon. <laughs> Amazon is one of the ways, bruh. They got Lacoste, Calvin Klein, Paul Jones. 
Just coming back here really quick just to see what's going on here. And they got kids stuff back here as well. Definitely come and check out Amazon Style here in Glendale if you have the opportunity to, you dig?